In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use the new rulers and guides that were introduced to Premiere Pro. To view guides and rulers in Adobe Premiere Pro, you need to first click on the program monitor. I'm going to click on view, and now I can click the show rulers. Just like in Photoshop or other Adobe programs, all you need to do is drag out guides onto your canvas there. I can drag it down now. I can check my horizon line in front Premiere Pro finally. If you want to get rid of guides, you can just simply drag it off or you can go back to the view menu and choose clear guides. If you want to be more precise with your adding guides, you can go to view, add guide or right click on this and choose add guide. Now you have some control over it. You can change the color of the guide. You can change the orientation. So if I want to choose horizontal or vertical, so if I change it to percent, I can do 50% vertical. And that's going to place the guide right in the middle. That's pretty cool. I can right click again, choose add guide. I can change this to horizontal. 50% look okay. Now I have myself two guides. You can save your favorite guide layouts as templates that you can export and share with others. And you can also import guide templates from programs such as Adobe After Effects. To save a template, simply go to view, guide templates, save guides as template. We're going to name this test. And to manage your guide templates, just go to view, Guide Templates, Manage Guides. I can rename the templates. I can delete the templates. I can import other guide templates from Adobe After Effects. I can also export these guide templates to use in other programs. And to make laying out text and graphics a lot easier, go up to View. Choose Snapped and Program Monitor now. When you drag it around, you see you get these smart guides and they'll snap right to the guides. That is how you use rulers and guides in Premiere Pro.